Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome to Farming Simulator 19 once again. Today we are back at our DOT shop here. New York State DOT. I should really get a sign or something. I should make a sign. But we got all our equipment here. We got this uh, truck that I just drove here. Uh, so unfortunately, I did not save the game last time after I made the video of taking everything here. So I had to redo it absolutely everything and bring everything here again. So that just ate up about a half an hour of my time. But anyways, we got everything here. We got some more stuff. Oh, we got this new dump truck here. We got this uh, pressure washer as well. I figured we could use the pressure washer to clean up our equipment. And uh, pretty much everything that was here before we brought. Um, I still might get some more stuff. We still might need to go get a few more things for this project here. Um, I'm not sure what we'll do with this wood here. We we'll gotta dispose of it somehow. But uh, today we're gonna be clearing some of these trees. So as you can see, we got this kind of tree line encroaching on us here. Um, we just put the shop down here, and we really could use some more of this driveway here. So I think we'll come in through here and cut all these down here. Just gotta watch out for the power lines. Uh, unfortunately, they are rigid. So you will hit them, because I ran into that trouble bringing this thing over here. This thing's super tall, and this thing likes to smack into the power lines when it's on the trailer. But anyways, let's get to cutting here. Uh, I like this Hitachi excavator. I've never used this processor head, but I'm going to give it a go here. I'm used to the Ponzi, so it's going to take a little bit of getting used to. Come on. What did I do here? Oh, God, turn it on. This thing isn't the most stable. kind of goes around a lot. Not sure why, but... I'll have to make do with it. Oh, it's caught up on the power lines. Oh, so it appears this thing does not like to drop them as nicely. But it's okay, we'll just drop it here. Let's see if we can cut this too. Tree type not support it. No surprise there. This one probably the same deal. Not supported, no big deal. I expected that. But these ones we should be uh, good to go on. Make sure I cut like this set correctly. We'll set that to like 8, ah, uh, 10. What's 10 look like? 10's gonna be a pretty good size. Uh, we'll put the tops over somewhere else. Not the most organized, but uh, we'll figure it out. Maybe we won't even bother with the tops. Separate them. Come on. Oh, we're all caught up here. Come on. See what this does. Oh, perfect. Oh, 
Come on. Third time's the charm. Kind of not the best. Ponzi is a lot smoother. I've got them all spun around here. There we go. Take down a few more. How did. Oh, I got the tree behind it somehow. Okay, we're just gonna let that go. Now I got that tree. That's weird, I've never had that happen before. I never grabbed the tree behind a tree that I was cutting. This will be just a total mess, so I have to come in here and just clear it up. Sometimes this header flops around and sometimes it does not. I noticed it's favored um, sticking straight up these treetops. But some people like that and they just separate up the tops. But I don't think I'm going to do that. I don't think I'm going to bother with that. I really wish I could get the Pondy Scorpion in here, but. Not so realistic. I don't think the New York State Department of Transportation has any of those. Alright. Oh, I should have processed that. I had to go back and cut all those, off, those limbs off by hand. There we go. Things go south real quick when you start throwing logs into the ends of other logs. Let's see what we can do here. Better. Yep, we're there. More than halfway there, just a few more logs, and we'll be good to go. Probably cut the rest out by hand. Just these birches are really what I wanted to use this thing for. This thing makes pretty short work of them. Somehow I'm still managing to get a pretty good pile going here. Maybe just these two more here. Stuck in a stump. There we go, not anymore. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure there's power lines over there. Oh, guess not. Stuck on a stump. 
as you do. Just hop over it. You would just be destroying your undercarriage. That fell nicely there. Let's just take this one down here, and I think that'll be good. We'll get the other ones by hand. No big deal. Which stump was in my way of this one? I want to cut this one down here. Doesn't look like I cut it. Oh, there we go. That should be low enough there. I think that's good there. I think that'll do it with this Hitachi excavator here. We'll finish off the rest with the case loader and the Bobcat skid steer. So, anyways, guys, if you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me your thoughts down below. Let me just run out of this building real quick. Leave your thoughts down below, and I'll catch you again in the next video.